Harvesting fish is an important part of your aquaculture operation and is often labor intensive. Careful planning in terms of pond construction and having the proper equipment can lead to great efficiencies. Yellow perch are typically harvested in the fall of their second year when water temperatures are below 60 degrees Fahrenheit. If harvesting during warmer months, well water can be added to keep the fish at optimum temperatures. Commercial yellow perch aquaculture ponds are typically rectangular in shape, shallow, and easily drainable. The bottom of the pond should slope gently toward the deep end where the drain is located at the lowest point. An internal catch basin, either concrete or compacted clay, can further ease harvest. In this case, the catch basin is an internal concrete muck. However, excavated depressions in the deep end of the pond work as well. It is important to have sufficient access around the pond for harvesting trucks and equipment. All of these attributes make harvesting easier. Complete pond harvest is accomplished by draining and seining. The pond is partially drained to lower the water level and concentrate the fish. A rectangular seine net is used to capture the fish. The net should have a weighted mud line, have a float line, have a mesh size of one quarter to three quarters of an inch, and be one and a half times the pond width and one and a half times its depth. The water in the pond is lowered and the fish are herded toward the drain end. Two saners draw the seine across the width of the pond and slowly pull toward the deep end. The seine poles are kept close to the shoreline to discourage fish from swimming around the net. In ponds that are half an acre or less, the seine can be pulled by hand. In larger ponds, the seines can be dragged by trucks or tractors. The saners pull the net until the ends of the seine meet in a predetermined location. This is often the corner of the pond. The saners grab the net at the bottom and slowly work the mud line up onto the shore, making sure no fish escape under the net. They continue to pull the net out of the water until the fish are corralled into a small pocket of the net. While removing them from the pond, every effort should be made not to stress the fish, especially if you plan to sell your fish live for pond stocking or as a food fish. Handle the fish gently to avoid scale loss or other trauma. Fish are transferred from the same net to the floating baskets using a dip net. Do not load the basket more than half full to prevent crushing the fish on the bottom. Baskets can then be loaded into a wading truck. Using oxygen and salt during transportation helps reduce stress and improve the quality of the final product. This process will be repeated two to three times or until the majority of the fish have been removed from the pond. The pond is then drained completely to remove the remaining fish. Once they flow into the monk, the fish can be easily removed with a dip net. Harvest can be very stressful on your fish. Having the right equipment as well as a harvest plan can ensure a smooth process that will reduce stress on your fish and result in a better quality product for your customers.